Hey everyone, and welcome back to the crawl. Let's play, and as per usual, the window isn't properly sized. Sorry if my voice sounds a bit odd. Mouth is bothering me, as per usual. Uh, I don't know what I want to be this time. Hmm. Uh, let's be an octopus. No armor, but they can wear eight rings, so that's pretty neat. Hmm. Turn things into snakes or magic. Hmm. Let's be a venom mage. I don't know why, I just like venom mages. I have a thing for poisons in general, actually. Which is probably kind of weird, but, you know. So what spells do we have? We have Sting. And we missed. Is it not poisoned? There. Okay, so our weapon is tentacles and we have nothing quivered. That's kind of odd. I'm not sure I like using tentacles as a weapon. Oh, I forgot to set up my skills. Uh, and Manual. <coughs> uh, sorry. Sorry. Uh, let's focus on poison magic. Mm, lower stealth for now. Not worried about that too much. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, not the club, the dart, yeah. And no, I don't care about that. Yeah, I want darts because... I don't want to get close to enemies, especially since I can't wear armor. So, having darts as an option would definitely be nice. Although we can just one-shot rats, apparently. It's good to know. A dagger, something that has a frost. I'll take the dagger. Can I actually wield weapons? Probably can, right? Yeah, I can. Good. I don't have to smack things around with tentacles. That's good, actually. Rookish dagger, I don't care about. Hmm. Oh, I should probably mention, one of the reasons I disable automatic skill prioritizing is be- oh, I can't wear armor, right? Is because um, when you like equip a new weapon or something, it will automatically activate that skill a lot of the time. But it doesn't deactivate when you unequip. And we reach level 2. So we should have a book, right? And somebody mentioned in the last video that we get spell slots when we level up. So yeah, I, I don't really think I need Cure Poison right now. Oh, I should probably butcher this guy. It sounds horrible. I should butcher this guy. But, you know, whatever, it's not like our character's human or anything. Hey, wizard hat. And we can wear it. Other armor we can't wear. Ooh. Don't like the look of that.
Okay. That's one nice thing about poison. While we're running away, we can still do damage to them. We seem to be quite a bit slower than these jackals, though. Which, I mean, it's understandable considering, you know, we're an octopus. But I would still like to be a bit faster than the things trying to murder me. Go through that. So it seems like we're strong enough to actually kill some of the weaker enemies with our dagger, which is nice. I feel like I'm speaking very quietly. I'm sorry if I am. I turned up the volume for my recording device a little bit to try to make up for how quiet I am because of my mouth bothering me, but I don't know if it's working. Like, it's Probably four decibels higher, so it's not a lot, but it should be enough. Normally when I record at this volume, it's enough to hear my chair in the background, so it should be enough to hear me, I hope. I'm trying to sit a little bit closer to the mic, too. Said uh, a kill you. And yeah, we basically went from magic missile spam to sting spam, I guess, but you know, whatever. So there's not really much going on there. Auto Explorer. Should have. Oh, well, I don't. Whatever. I'll find something, I'm sure. Or not. Huh. Iguana. Oh, I don't have any special abilities. Um. Damn. I'll try one more character. Uh, this time let's not be a random wild animal. Uh, always looking for rotten food, hacking away with their claws. Vampires were pretty fun when I tried them. They're really stealthy, but they're not as slow as the Naga. Uh, I don't really like elves that much. Depraved elf might be fun though. Mm, strong combatants and adept at using magic. Let's become our folk. Why not be a fish? Um, what's death knight? Yeah, I'll be a death knight. And I'll take a spear. 16 stones, so might as well pick them up to throw at people. Couldn't hurt, right? Well, I could, but I probably won't. Alright, skills. Wrong order. So, turn off fighting. Somebody told me that fighting is less useful than an actual weapon skill, so I'll focus on a weapon skill for now. Mm. I'll keep invocations going. Keep the other two going. Our pull arm skill should go up pretty fast, though. And do we have the ability to animate dead? Yes. Oh. Oh, I have to actually stand on top of it. Okay. the magic to animate in their ally. So somebody, I think the same person, actually mentioned the T button 
Let's do command your allies. Okay, cool. Well, I'm going to have them stick to following me for right now. But that's pretty neat. It's good to know, I never actually knew that. So, come on my zombie friends. Let's go make more of you. That's... Hmm, I can't butcher it. I guess there was no body or something. Let's take a nap. And raise the dead. It's an odd way to wake up. Take a nap, wake up, raise the dead. Okay, leveled up. Uh, 18 more stones I'll pick up. Should probably start using them now that I think of it actually. It's probably not going to do a significant amount of damage throwing rocks at people, but you know, any little bit counts. Can't go diagonal through that wall. But yeah, like even just a couple points of damage can make a difference, so. So if I pray over a corpse, no. It doesn't actually get rid of the corpse. That's good to know, actually. I thought it would. More uh, undead. Pick up that rock again. Don't really care about a dart. I fail to use my ability? What? So I'm getting hungry pretty fast here. I should probably butcher this goblin and eat chunks of goblin. Yeah. Cool. Chainmail. H. Where? Um. No. Let's, uh. H where? That perk? Yes. Okay. And apparently my minion kills still give me favor for whoever our deity is. I don't I don't want to even attempt to pronounce that name. But yeah. That's good. Do I have any? No. I was gonna say, do I have any food or any meat chunks? But apparently, I do not. Good. Uh, and I will eat your flesh. at you. Yeah, the rocks didn't really do much of anything, but it's good to have them anyway, I suppose. Probably doesn't actually matter. Uh, Auto Explorer. I don't think minions will actually follow you downstairs or anything like that. the strength. But yeah, I don't think they follow you downstairs, so it doesn't really matter that much. If I leave them behind. Do I have anything that might help with this poison? I have a potion. Couldn't hurt, right? Well, you know, it actually helped. 
Uh, goblin. I'll eat that goblin. And my train of zombies will follow me over here to pick up more rocks. I somewhat doubt I actually need to do anything for this gecko. Yeah. I'll raise it from the dead though. So I haven't really needed to tell my minions to do anything yet. But it's good to know that I can. Uh, do I have any chunks? I do. I'm still nauseous. Or am I nauseous again from eating chunks of goblin? That might be the case, actually. Okay, next floor. Markish leather I don't really care about. Another scroll. I'm gonna try out some of these. Uh, I'll try it on the other scroll. Scroll of identify. Lines of teleportation and random uselessness. That's useful. No, actually it's not useful at all. <laughs> it even says in the scroll name that it's not useful. Which I guess is pretty nice of it. A scale compared to what I'm wearing. 6, 3 versus 7, 4. Yeah, I'll wear this. And I thought that was a cape, not a robe, so happy I checked and put that chainmail back on. Quaka. Fuming Silvery Potion. For some reason I want to say that has mercury in it. I'm hungry and poisoned and probably about to die. Well, let's see what this does. Invisibility. That doesn't help me at all. Hmm. Oh well. Cloak, I don't care about. Can I eat any of those chunks or are they too rotten? Too rotten, I guess. Uh, level four. Oh. Bring a zombie to life. And eat those. I can't stomach food right now. Oh, well, that's not good. I actually have to eat some of my actual food. You know, not the stuff that I just sort of cut off of random enemies. You can now recall your undead slaves and mirror injuries on your foes. What? Cool. Injury mirror and recall undead slaves. So I guess recall undead slaves just brings them back to me. And injury mirror, whatever damage they do to me, they also do themselves. Something like that. So let's see. Okay, so that actually lowered my piety, apparently. So I should not do that very often. Good to know. Well, I can still summon monsters, at least. How long am I going to be nauseous? Gun. Yeah, I'll eat Adder Flesh. I didn't even know I still had Adder Flesh, but I'll eat it. <clears throat> I think I'm going to cut this episode soon. My throat's really starting to hurt. 
Uh, looks like you might cut this episode for me, actually. Uh, I have rocks, right? Now I would hit my ally. Level is mine, all mine. Okay. What do I have on me? Uh, G, read, O. Oh. Recharging. Uh, nothing. Hmm. Yeah, so. I don't know if I can actually handle him in a head to head fight. Uh, it looks like he healed himself a bit. Mouth gets too much lower, I'm gonna have to run now. Yeah. He doesn't like bat zombies. No, he's close enough to attack now. My chainmail prevent me from hitting him. What? That's kind of annoying. actually eat that meat ration then. Huh. Okay, well, that was closer than I wanted it to be. But I think that's enough excitement for this episode. I'll see you next time, guys. Bye!